way. Huh? And the car's parked over there. Oh, so we have a teacher's meeting today, which is amazing because I get to see my baby's classroom and uh, yeah, how he's getting on with his teachers, aren't we, baby? Mm -hmm. Yeah, so after I get home, you guys, I have such a massive cleaning to do. It's not even a joke. I mean, am I exaggerating? Oh, yes, Maybe home. just a bit because it is so later in the day for me to be even doing this and then I have a guest coming over later on um, that I need to get ready for Ugh. yeah guys like I was saying I have guests coming over so Even I need him, to go I and do this quickly uh, then I come home clean and then get us ready for our guest that's coming over so you guys we just got back in the car it actually went really well i met his teacher she's a lovely young lady um she's quite young um yeah she was really really nice she had positive things to say about khalil's first two weeks uh two weeks already you know it's already been two weeks since they've been back at school but yeah, she had nothing but positive things to say about this little man. I mean, I've never had problem with his learning. Alhamdulillah, with all my children, we put the work in every single day at home as well as school. I don't just let them learn at school and then come home and then it's free play. Um, we always do 30 minutes of learning every day. Um, I can't do more than that because they are enrolled to several different things uh, that they got to get work ready for as well. But yeah, you guys, it was really, really nice. A lot of parents have turned up. Um, Khalil actually goes to an academy. Uh, he is very, very fortunate. He also worked really, really hard, you guys, for him to get into this. And uh, um, yeah, I don't know what else to say, but yeah, I'm just really, really happy with the feedback. Um, this little um. man, he's going places, you guys. Remember this little face, okay? Because this man is going places and I couldn't have been more proud of him. It's a teamwork, we all chip in to help the children to do their work, to make sure that they're on top of their learning, everything is done, everything is completed. And when they go to school, they perform that and they show that, you know, they are from this home and uh, this is what they do. And uh, yeah, his effort into his work is just outstanding, you guys. But yeah, why are you laughing like that? Oh my God, can you stop? You guys, me and Khalil decided to go to Asda really, really quickly. Um, we had such a bad heat wave lately. Um, I feel like it's going to rain right now, but inshallah it doesn't. Um, yeah, we're going to go to Asda. I really need to get house shopping in. I have been waiting for Sully to be a that week where he's actually at home for me to go house shopping. Uh, there hasn't been that time yet. So when me and Khalil are right now, Sully's at home today. So me and Khalil just finished and we're gonna go to Asda and do house shopping he's my right hand man today he's gonna help me out aren't you Hoyo? I'm always okay yeah mm, my baby you guys my baby mashallah tabarakallah he's growing he has always a grumpy face now which is really really sad because he has such a beautiful face and I feel like you have to just smile but yeah you guys and then once I get home it's back to cleaning and then hopefully we need to clean and then guests coming over. So you guys just got back in. It's so cloudy but hopefully the weather's going to shine through. But I'm going to quickly get changed and uh, yeah I'm going to get changed and start my cleaning you guys. Because it's been raining, it's so cloudy, it's dark outside, but the sun is gonna shine through, not to worry you guys. So I'm just gonna quickly get upstairs, pray my namaz, and then start on my cleaning. <laughs> I folded my pants you guys, because it was raining outside, and I didn't want it touching the floor, because I can't, I just can't afford it for it getting dirty, so. Yeah, today's outfit, I think I wore this before you guys, I think you've seen me wear this before. Um, not quite sure, but yeah, got these lovely baggy pants from uh, uh, Topshop, and then my shirt is from Mango, and then I have one of Munira's um, headscarves on, 
because I feel like it just goes so well with the outfit but yeah you guys this is so bloody modest like I can't think of any more modest outfit than this like the shirt is quite lengthy the trousers quite baggy but yeah and the trousers also high-waisted you guys but yeah you guys need to stop mabbling away and start on my cleaning so let's go Every morning I do this, I fold all the clothes that I've washed the night before and uh, tidy up the room so they can have the whole day to play. At the moment they are in the garden, thanks to the weather, it is beautiful outside so they're not indoors as much. But yeah you guys, I've just... the room wasn't really messy to be honest with you guys. It was just that I had a lot of washing that I've taken off the rails and I've put in here. But yeah you guys this is what we are dealing with at the moment this is probably gonna last until tomorrow morning until i have to put the next load of washing you guys as you can see there is a load of clothes that's still drying so i might have to just chuck that in here and just tidy up and um, i've moved out of the kids cupboards you guys and look how empty everything is you guys you can literally see the floor here but yeah you guys so i said i'm a hoarder so i have like documents so you guys since i have moved out of the boys room with my clothes you guys room and i have left all their cupboards all empty you guys and uh, yeah it's summer donated most of the winter stuff and they have their summer stuff but their cupboards are looking pretty empty you guys everything is literally empty in their room at the moment most of the cupboards are empty you guys and uh, like i said most of the cupboards are quite empty you guys and it's just this one i've done for harun i've just put his stuff in don't know what the label's still doing there and i've done this for bin yamin all their jumpers for the evening because they like to play outside but yeah you guys everything else is all empty here i've just used the so here I've just used for the bed sheet and the real majority of it's empty. You guys, yesterday I went to Ikea and bought a couple of stuff that I need to put away. And uh, yeah. Something else new in Monera's room is, you guys, I gave her my old wardrobe. I have changed into my brain gap because it's nearly the whole, you guys. I need to pray. This is Monera's cupboard now. I have put it in her room you guys it is quite small this is what I had in my room and like I said you guys the children you guys the children are in school five days a week uh, it's only weekends and the weekends they go to either tuition or mosque so we don't have that much clothes except from Abayas yeah so you guys everybody's very I've already done Monero school uniform you guys Monero has a few trousers and um, this is where she keeps all her stuffed toys because she doesn't like showing you guys and this is my little pookie bear you guys how cute was Monera like how adorable was she you guys such a cutie and um, this is where I've just put her camera you guys my daughter's into perfumes and my daughter loves perfume you guys I don't really like the smell of this but my her grandma got her this 
and um, Nana actually got her this you guys I feel like this is a little bit bougie for her but I've got one and uh, she was like I need one and she asked her grandma and our grandma actually got it for her this smells you guys exactly the same smell as Dior Mamazelle honest to god it smells exactly like it and here's uh, her study books her reading books and uh, most of her revision papers you guys they're the revision papers and then on her desk she has a candle you guys she loves to light a candle um just chucked two away so i've just replaced one and this is a little bit like i said a bit bougie for her but then again it's Monero. what can we do you guys she loves it this was actually gifted to me the other one i've only burned it once because that's how amazing it smells you guys but yeah and then she has her laptop recently when we got her sunny headphones and um, my daughter is into autumn it doesn't matter whether it's spring summer wherever the season is you guys she's still stuck on autumn yesterday we went to tk maxx and uh, she purchased this because she was like autumn's around the corner her favorite season and yeah nothing has changed in her room you guys and uh, yeah I'm picking up the camera quite late, you guys. I was in the kitchen half of the day cooking, weren't I? Wasn't I, Phil? I have a feeling they can't see my ponytail, so they think I'm bald. <laughs> they can see your little ponytail. Uh, uh, Phil's he's growing right. his hair. So most of the food is still in the stove because I want to keep it warm, but this is what it's looking like at the moment. So I've just got the salad ready. is nice and ready you guys i think i showed you the curtains that we got how cute and um so it just keeps picking things up off the floor and um Karen and Benjamina in the garden but yeah you guys we are all nice and ready <laughs> oh my God, you guys the worst thing is waiting isn't it the worst part of hosting is the waiting part because I want to keep the food warm but I want to display it as well. It's the best way, as soon as they calm down, go yeah. outside yeah. and get the food ready. Oh my god, I feel like we need to keep coming. That's what you've done. You've got the dinner thing with Dana. Oh, she's just lying. I don't have any. Can you hear? 